I think the majority of we the Liberians are lazy. Very, very lazy. We don't want to work. You know, we look around and we complain about the Lebanese, and we complain about the Indians, and we complain about the Fulas. But these people, most of them, come with practically nothing. And we see them with a wheelbarrow or on the sidewalk, cleaning shoes or something. Within a few months' time, the man is able to get a location and start his business. And we employ some of we, the Liberians, to go and be working with him. Look around us in Morovia here. It is not possible, even in the great United States where they have the billions and billions of dollars, it is not possible for the government to employ every citizen in this country. It is not possible. <coughs> so we have to go out there and do things for ourselves. You can't sit down supinely and let everything be handed to you on a silver platter. Some of us who made it to life, we did not make it sitting down. We worked. Today, when I sleep, I sleep peacefully because all I accomplish in life, I worked for it. In those days, they had what they used to call MPA. I used to have parented my salary to a bank of Liberia for a whole year. How much was the salary? But I take that little money, take the risk, and venture into buying a car and a bus. They gave you, you pay that for six months, and they gave you another six months to pay. So while one car is running, paying the, the garage, garages, the other one sending my children to school and help and uh, doing what I'm doing. And so I tell my friends, sometimes they come there, younger girls, and they say, when I get old, I want to be like you. I say, well, you got to start now. Not every piece of cloth you see you want to buy. Not every piece of jewelry you want to buy. You will have to make that sacrifice now if you want to be like Mother Brownell tomorrow. So, I mean, and just stay. We just sit down and, you know, the next thing in that bureau here, we complain. We complain. We criticize. We don't want to do anything. I don't care what they put Jesus in that mansion. We will criticize. Anything we will criticize. We don't want to do anything. We just want to fold our hands. Now we have taken to arm robbery and other things. You know, and all of those things there. Here, let us get our people. Let them go back to the soil. There was a program in Liberia years ago where at the end of each time or something, the county raising the most amount of food stuff will be given a prize. And most of the time, Lofa will win with a $10,000 award for them to go and do their farming. And this was an inspiration. I listen to the radio, I read the newspaper every day. I hear the agriculture ministry, or uh, minister is so and so. They give, uh, this uh, uh, donor is giving money for this agriculture project and all that. There are people go back and plant their rice. They don't go back. Every day, rice, rice, rice. How many of them also have to then give a full terrified dollar for one bag of rice? They can go and plant their rice. And then the next person compared to eat rice every day. The cassava is there. The arrow there. The planting there. Why we can't plant it and grow our own food? We must all sit in Morovia and wait to be fed. And go around begging and all that kind of thing. I tell you now, where I stay in my house, I'm afraid to come on my push during the daytime. I have to stay in my room because by the time I come on my push and people pass on the street, I still see me they come with a long problem. My child is not eating today, and all I say, you know how old I am? I'm an old, old, old lady. You understand? I'm a retired old lady. So you are trying to get behind me. And so this is a girl, this is our problem. Unless we, the Liberian people, become conscious, we, the Liberian people, become serious, we'll be like this. We cannot sit down and wait for hand out, hand out, hand out all the time. Somebody must please, and a please, and a please, 
and a priest. Who tell you sometimes somebody a priest or gave you something? Every day, please, 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 please. So let us go out there and do things for ourselves. Let our people go back where they come from. Make their farms, what they used to do long ago. Eh? I remember when I, you know,